It's an accordion thing. You wouldn't understand. Hello, accordion player. This is accordion sensation Smiling Jack in the practice room. Today you will not have the pleasure of seeing my handsome smiling face, but I will bring up a mini me so you can remember who it is that's speaking. Today it's all about the fingers on my left hand playing bass, a pattern that I love. Boogie woogie goes back to my youth. It's a two bar pattern, four notes in each bar. There's also a walking version of it that would be eight notes in each bar that includes you playing a chord button. I'll demonstrate that later. But first, what are the notes if we start on C bass? So the notes are C, E, counter bass to C, G, A, counter bass to F, B flat, back down, A, G, E. The fingering is optional, whatever is comfortable for you. This is starting with finger two on C, two, three, two, four, five, four, two, three. You could play starting with three. Three, four, two, four, five, four, two, four. So it's a pattern. Once it's memorized, you just move to whatever bass you want and you have the pattern ready to go. So I'll move from C to F to G and back to C. Change to F. You could also do a pattern where when you get to G, instead of the full pattern, just play four beats, four notes, and then down to F for the second half of the pattern. C again. Change to F. C, G for half the pattern, stop on four, move to F, back to C. Now the walking bass version is eight notes in each measure, eighth notes, bass and chord. So we'll start on C. Second finger will be needed for the chord, so you will use different fingering for the bass. <laughs> is fun. I learned that 
at the very beginning when I was learning this pattern. <laughs> to G for half the pattern, down to F for the other half. It's up to you. Depends on the song you're playing. slow at first. And then, when it comes to the right hand, if you're creative and want to compose your own right hand, it's up to you, the changes. But once you have this pattern down, you can apply it whenever you want. I've applied the boogie pattern to the Pennsylvania polka in one of my episodes. Also, if you're creative, you'll end up coming up with your own patterns. I did for Hey Good Looking years ago, I created a pattern just for Hey Good Looking. <laughs> That's the pattern. The chord changes are different for the song. I made that up. At least I think I did. So, have fun with it. Woogie woogie. Learn the pattern. Start on any bass you choose. And uh, vary the pattern using your creativity. Have fun with it. Practice and keep smiling while you're practicing.